I've never been like a ambitious, calculated, like I have a whole plan and I have to get to here. I wasn't ever hungry, hungry. I was just grateful to work. I honestly knew that to be, be an actor is tough, to be a working actor is even harder. For the day with one person, switch lives. Whose life would you switch with? Um, somebody who maybe doesn't get followed by paparazzi. Perfect. Whoever that is. I don't know why I'm still here. <laughs> I just feel I'm, I just love going to work. amazing storyline. I had an amazing storyline that, that I got a lot to play with and you know and it was just a, a luck. Rachel has grown up really beautifully and you know she, they rounded her out and given her a lot of life to you know interesting experiences, life experiences and, and given me a lot of fun stuff to play. Monogamy is something that's difficult for all people in marriages to struggle with, or? Well, I haven't gotten to that part, point in my life yet, but uh, I'm sure it's, it's, it's something that occurs in marriages. So Monogamy is man-made, you know. Jennifer Aniston, she handled this in a classy manner. She could have lashed out to the media about Angie Jolie stealing her husband. Instead, she dealt with it in a more spiritual manner, and she worked on her pain uh, doing, by doing yoga and uh, traveling and uh, hanging out with friends. poke fun at the whole tabloid culture, the whole obsession with the, that they created stories to pit the two against each other. I mean, they probably don't even think about each other on a daily basis, but according to Us Weekly and Star, you know, one's bitter, one's, you know, fertile, one's, you know, always getting her heart broken. We're fans of both of them, believe me, and it's more making fun of, like, the tabloid life and the industry and our own obsession with them and just how we put them against each other when probably they're, they're not.
around my personal life. As I grew older, I started to get more, more, more sort of focused on on the parts that I wanted to play, and that I wanted. I just knew I wanted to break out and do other things. applaud uh, Jennifer. Jennifer's, um, I hate that she had felt she had to do it, but she, I think she just had enough to be in this business and be hounded the way she is and, and everybody making up her narrative and, and, and putting it out there like it's the truth, that she's like desperate to have a baby and she's, de you know, it's just, it's just they're trying to sell papers at someone else's expense and it's, it's, not, it's not fair and it's not, uh, it's just, it's despicable. Feel, it's so strange because that feels like yesterday.